Catholic Daily Mass Readings for April 29, 2022, Friday of the second week of Easter, Daily Homily First Reading, Acts 534-42 But one in the council rising up, a Pharisee, named Gamaliel, a doctor of the law, respected by all the people, commanded the men to be put forth a little while. And he said to them, Ye men of Israel, take heed to yourselves what you intend to do, as touching these men. For before these days rose up Theodas, affirming himself to be somebody, to whom a number of men, about four hundred, joined themselves, who was slain. And all that believed him were scattered, and brought to nothing. After this man, rose up Judas of Galilee, in the days of the enrolling, and drew away the people after him, he also perished. And all, even as many as consented to him, were dispersed. And now, therefore, I say to you, refrain from these men, and let them alone, for if this counsel or this work be of men, it will come to naught. But if it be of God, you cannot overthrow it, lest perhaps you be found even to fight against God. And they consented to him. And calling in the apostles, after they had scourged them, they charged them that they should not speak at all in the name of Jesus. And they dismissed them. And they indeed went from the presence of the council, rejoicing that they were accounted worthy to suffer reproach for the name of Jesus. And every day they ceased not in the temple, and from house to house, to teach and preach Christ Jesus. Responsorial Psalm, Psalms 27, 1, 4, 13, 14 Response One thing I seek, to dwell in the house of the Lord. The Psalm of David before he was anointed. The Lord is my light and my salvation, whom shall I fear? The Lord is the protector of my life, of whom shall I be afraid? Response One thing I seek, to dwell in the house of the Lord. One thing I have asked of the Lord, this will I seek after. That I may dwell in the house of the Lord all the days of my life. That I may see the delight of the Lord, and may visit his temple. Response One thing I seek, to dwell in the house of the Lord. 13. I believe to see the good things of the Lord in the land of the living. 14. Expect the Lord, do manfully, and let thy heart take courage, and wait thou for the Lord. Response. 1. Thing I seek, to dwell in the house of the Lord. Alleluia. Matthew 4. 4. B. Response. Alleluia. Alleluia. 4. B. One does not live on bread alone, but on every word that comes forth from the mouth of God. Response. Alleluia. Alleluia. Gospel. John 6. 1 to 15 After these things Jesus went over the Sea of Galilee, which is that of Tiberias. And a great multitude followed him, because they saw the miracles which he did on them that were diseased. Jesus therefore went up into a mountain, and there he sat with his disciples. Now the Pasch, the festival day of the Jews, was near at hand. When Jesus therefore had lifted up his eyes, and seen that a very great multitude cometh to him, he said to Philip, Whence shall we buy bread, that these may eat? And this he said to try him, for he himself knew what he would do. Philip answered him, Two hundred pennyworth of bread is not sufficient for them, that every one may take a little. One of his disciples, Andrew, the brother of Simon Peter, said to him, There is a boy here that hath five barley loaves, and two fishes, but what are these among so many? Then Jesus said, Make the men sit down. Now there was much grass in the place. The men therefore sat down, in number about five thousand. And Jesus took the loaves, and when he had given thanks, he distributed to them that were set down. In like manner also of the fishes, as much as they would. And when they were filled, he said to his disciples, Gather up the fragments that remain, lest they be lost. They gathered up therefore, and filled twelve baskets with the fragments of the five barley loaves, which remained over and above to them that had eaten. Now those men, when they had seen what a miracle Jesus had done, said, This is of a truth the prophet, that is to come into the world. Jesus therefore, when he knew that they would come to take him by force, and make him king, fled again into the mountain himself alone.